Sarah Jones. Welcome to my home studio in beautiful Portland, Oregon. My name is Sarah Jones. I'm an author, illustrator, and designer, and I have written a number of children's books with Blue Manity Press, including Lloyd Lama. So I first started writing children's books after working at Blue Manatee Children's Bookstore and falling in love with the selection of children's books that they have there. They were all so beautiful and clever and I loved reading them and watching kids enjoy them. And as an artist, I really wanted to share my art with the world and I thought this was a great opportunity to do that. So I created my first book, Orange Triangle Fox, and I just loved the experience so much that I had to keep going. I came up with the idea for Lloyd Lama while I was working at Blue Manatee. And one thing I really wanted to explore with a book was how we can teach kids about friendship, about differences, and also a little bit about spelling too. So through alliteration, some spelling cues, and some really fun little rhymes, uh, kids can learn a whole lot from this book over and over again. Lloyd Llama is the story of a really cute, fluffy pink llama who loves things with double L's, like roller coasters, lollipops, and the color yellow. Even his friends really love things with double L's. Tilly meets Al Alpaca, who likes things that start with the letter A. And at first they don't think that they can get along because of their different interests. But as the book goes on, they learn that despite their differences, that they can still be really good friends. And at the end, they also find common ground between them. My favorite part of the book is when Al and Lloyd realize that they have some things in common. And it starts on this page. Until one day it all would change, it started with a sneeze. Al and Lloyd then realized they both had allergies, a word that has an A and two L's. And after that, the two of them become great friends, exploring all of the things that they both enjoy with A's and double L's. I had a lot of fun creating the character of Lloyd Lama because he likes things with double L's and it was kind of a challenge to find things that had double L's that Lloyd might like. But as it turns out, he has a lot of things in common with me. So one of the things that Lloyd loves is playing the cello. And that's one of the things that I did when I was a kid. He also loves his friends, Stella, Billy, and Willow. And I had a lot of fun creating these characters as well because they also have double L's in their names. Stella Gazelle, Billy Bullfrog, and Willow Armadillo. The book is full of these little fun details and I absolutely loved creating those little elements. To make my books, I first start with a sketch and then I color it in with a special paint called gouache. So this is the type of paint that I use. It's kind of like watercolor paint. And I use these big sheets of paper to come up with all of my drawings. So here you can see some originals that I have from the book Lloyd Mama and also some unfinished pieces. So let's finish this one together. When I'm all done painting, I have lots of different elements that are on different pages. So in order to get all of this onto one spread for my book, I'll scan it into my computer and layer it all together in order to create the final spread. Lloyd Lama didn't always look the way he did. It took a lot of sketching and character ideas in order to get him just right. This is one of the first pictures of Lloyd Lama that I came up with. Do you think he looks the same? Thing I do is I sketch my character. I just use a regular pencil and some watercolor paper. Cute little Lloyd. He's got a fluffy little chin. He's got a lot of fluff on top of his head. 
and some baggy eyes. And don't forget all of his really fluffy fur. Then I mix my paints. I use gouache and a palette. And in order to make pink, I have to mix together red and white. Now it's time to add some color. And lastly, we finish off our drawing with a black colored pencil. Just go over all the details and outlines. This really makes it feel like a finished drawing. I also like to add a little bit of shading at this point. After going over the drawing with a black colored pencil, all of the details are all filled in. Now it feels like a finished drawing. who's also interested in becoming an author, illustrator, or artist, really anything creative, the thing that's the most important to remember is to keep at it. There's lots and lots and lots of practice and lots of time that goes into making a book like Lloyd Lama. And I didn't start off with a lot of talent. I, as a kid, needed to practice a whole lot. And so with lots of practice, you can get better and better. Thank you for visiting my studio. I hope you had fun watching how I create Lloyd Lama and some of my children's books. Come again sometime.